Hey everyone! So for this Valentine's Day, I wanted to show you guys how to make this really cute and simple DIY gift idea if you don't know what to give your significant other or friend or just anyone that you want to show some love to. And if you want to know how I did this, then just keep watching. So the first thing that you're going to do is you're going to make a stencil for the stomach and the top of the head and you're going to use it on the piece of fabric that you chose to cut out. Once you've cut out all your pieces, you're just going to glue them on. Now you're going to get a piece of ribbon and you're going to glue it around the edge of the lid. On the stomach, you're going to make a border, and I use this piece of ribbon that I just cut into pieces so that it's easier to go around on the stomach. But you can use whatever you want, and that's the whole point of this DIY, is that you just want to get creative with it and use whatever you have. I forgot to film this part, but I just found random roses and then I put them all together and then I made a bow in between it and then I just stuck it on the top of the lid. For the tail of the bear, I'm just going to get this fuzzy fabric and glue it until I make a ball. On the neck of the bear, I'm going to get this piece of ribbon and glue it all the way around. For the bow on the bear, you're going to get a piece of fabric and cut a square that's 5 inches by 5 inches and then you're going to fold it in half and you're going to sew all the way around it leaving a little space so that you could turn it inside out and I'm just sewing down and up the whole time.
Once you've turned it inside out, you're just gonna get a pair of scissors or anything pointy and just bring out the corners more. After you do that, you're just gonna fold it in half and make a line and you're gonna sew the same way down and up all the way across. Once you've sewn all the way to the end, you're going to pull the thread until it creates the form of the bow. After you're satisfied with how it looks, you're just going to make a knot at the end. For the center of the bow, I decided to put this little rose, but you can choose whatever you want. Once you've finished making your bow, all you have to do is glue it on. So when you buy these animal crackers, the jar actually has stickers for the eyes, but I decided to remove them because they're usually off-center, and I just thought it would be cuter if I painted on the eyes and nose. Now here's the fun part where you get to decide what kind of treat you want to fill the jar with. I just decided that I wanted to fill it with popcorn and I drizzled it with dark chocolate and pink chocolate. Once you're finished with everything, it should look something like this. What's really great about this gift is that once they eat everything that's inside of the jar, they can actually still keep the jar and use it for storage for whatever they want. Like I use it for storing my makeup, but you can put anything you want inside. You don't even have to decorate it for Valentine's Day. You can decorate it in any way you want and just be really creative with it. And yeah, I hope you guys like this DIY video. I had so much fun making it. And I hope you guys have an amazing Valentine's Day. Thanks for watching. Bye.